Hey, what's going on guys? Uh, your boy Jay Bizzle. Just uh, headed on the road here, headed to Amory, Mississippi to hang out with a bunch of uh, my mentors, kind of basing off of yesterday, you know, it's time to you know, go out and get some mentors. Uh, yesterday, uh, you know, I kind of pointed that out, and today I'm actually going to go hang out with a room full of six, seven-figure earners uh, to, to get knowledge from them. You know, when you're around somebody like that, my biggest suggestion is just kind of keep your mouth shut and just really, really listen to what they have to say. Uh, so, right on Baldwin Beach Express. Get a little GPS going, but I, uh, I just wanted to uh, kind of make a video and explain to you guys um, a little bit, especially you guys that are headed to go get your dreams. Uh, you know, it's going to be tough. It's going to be hard. I was actually listening to uh, Les Brown today. And um, if you guys don't know who Les Brown is, you gotta look him up on YouTube. Guy is incredible. 13 minutes to I-10 West. Sweet, made it to I-10. Uh, <laughs> but uh, the guy's incredible. And uh, so the biggest, uh, biggest thing he was talking about was as you're going and you're driving and you're going to get your dreams and uh, everything uh, that you've ever wanted, everything you've ever wanted to accomplish. There's gonna be, you know, bumps in the road. There's gonna be hazards. There's gonna be things that you're gonna have to overcome. And a lot of that is maybe changing up the way you're doing things. Uh, so he told an awesome story that uh, that I thought was very interesting, especially for you folks out there in the maybe the sales field. Um, he was uh, he was in Chicago, and he was walking up and down uh, the street, uh, or he was just walking up the street, I guess. And uh, he was headed to a meeting, was in a big hurry. You know, all the guys there were like, you know, shoe shine guys wanting to shine your shoes. Hey, man, let me shine your shoes. Hey, man, the shoes look dirty. Let me get them shoes. Uh, you know, all that good stuff. He was just kind of blown by all of them. And then uh, he heard the next shoe shine guy was saying uh, 97, 98, 99. And then looked at Les and said 100. And uh, Les Brown was like, okay, I'm number 100. What does that mean? And uh, the guy said, look, uh, it's my birthday, and uh, every year on my birthday, the hundredth person that walks by my booth, I offer them a free shoe shine, and uh, you know, just to thank everybody for their uh, support of me and all that good stuff, and uh, giving good faith and whatnot. So, uh, so he thought, all right, well, cool. You know, it's your birthday, absolutely. I'll let you shine my shoes. So Les sits down, and this guy just vigorously shines his shoes, and you know, his shoes have never looked as pretty as they they were then, and uh, so. Yeah, as they were uh, getting done and whatnot, the uh, Les Brown looks at the uh, shoe shine guy and says, uh, "You know, how, how much do you normally charge for a shoe shine?" And the guy said, two dollars." And Les Brown said, "You know what? Because you shine my shoes so well, and you know it's your birthday and all, I'm going to give you five. So he gave him five dollars. So he gave him the two dollars and then a three dollar tip on top of it. And uh, as Les Brown was walking away, he thought, man, that's, that's some good looking shoes. He could hear in the background the guy go, 97, 98, 99. <laughs> so uh, the guy perfected his hustle, guys. That's what it's all about. So maybe just changing some of the ways you're doing your stuff. You know, if you're a football coach in the system that you're running right now, everybody knows about it. It doesn't mean you're done. It just means that you got to change your hustle a little bit and see what you can do and and if anything else in life if you're not challenging yourself all the time life gets boring man so get out there challenge yourself be a champion every day do the best you can do every day and i will holler at y'all very soon it's your boy bizzle holler